Hi, happy Thriving Thursday. Thanks for joining me this week. I'm really excited to share something with you today about stress and the benefits of exercise to help your body recover from the impact of your stress reaction on your body. You see, recently we had a stress management workshop. Robert Erkstam from Self Care Therapy came in and spoke to participants about stress management. And it was an absolutely amazing workshop packed full of incredible information that we can actually do something about. So not only did we all come to understand how stress affects our body better, but we also learned a lot of techniques on how to make that situation healthier for our body, right? How we can be more resilient to stress. And one of the things that he said that really stuck in my mind was that we have this primitive body living in a modern world. And he went on to talk about how our body's stress reaction um, is, is a primitive kind of response, right? Our body goes through, when there's a stressor from the external world, our body releases hormones. That release of hormones prepares us for that fight or flight and what he calls the fight, flight, or freeze reaction. And, you know, we respond accordingly. And so one thing he was saying is that the, the stressors in our world today aren't really acute as often as they are chronic, right? Um, in the past, there were acute stressors we had to react to survive. And now the stressors are kind of more um, in, insidious, right? They, they build up over time and, and they're just, they're always there. And so it's a more chronic condition instead of an acute happening right now type of condition. But our body's response is still based on that need for an acute response to stress. So this is what happens. You have a stress in your life and your body releases hormones immediately. Those hormones make your heart race. They make your breath work faster. Your muscles tense and get ready for action, right? And then you don't do anything because this stress is just one upon another, upon another, upon another, that is causing these reactions in your life. And if we don't do anything to release that, then we are potentially harming ourselves because that state of chronic stress that so many of us stay in really can do a lot of damage to your health. One thing that Robert said that we can do is exercise. Now I know you've heard it before, this isn't brand new information. We know that exercise helps with stress, but doesn't it help to know exactly why that is? If you imagine your body in this stress response, right? Your heart is racing, your breath is ready, your muscles are tense, your body needs to react. Well, one of the ways that we can relieve that response to stress is to react by exercising. Because exercising will work those muscles, it will use that energy that your body has built up for that stress reaction, it'll make use of it and put you in a more relaxed state afterward. So one thing we know for sure is that exercise helps you to manage your stress and over time helps you become more resilient to the stresses in your life. So this week, when you're feeling stressed, one of the best things you can do is find a little window of time and relieve that stress. Go get some exercise. You'll feel better. That's it for this week. I can't wait to see you next week. We're going to talk some more about stress in your life and how we can manage it. And make sure that you are staying on top of our excellent new workshops. We've got new ones all the time and a great schedule. Check our Facebook page events for all of the workshops that we've got planned so far for this year. And make sure you RSVP and come check us out. Let's thrive together, folks. Thanks for joining me.